Gonna do Volcano by Damien Rice, so we're gonna go over some chords, we're gonna go over the picking pattern, and we'll go over the strum pattern for the chords. So let's go straight to it. Chords are quite straightforward. Uh, we're gonna use an A minor, which is our uh, G string, which is this string here, our top one, uh, and it is the second fret. Now mine, again, will sound a bit different uh, if you haven't got a low G on it. Uh, the song still works without a low G, so don't worry about it. So A minor. <laughs> Uh, we're going to use an F as well, which is almost the same as A minus. Keep your middle finger where it is, and then your forefinger is going to go onto the E string. Mm -hmm. So the E string, first fret is here, so third string down. Uh, we're also going to use a G. So a G is one of your basic kind of chords. So it's going to be second fret on your A and C strings. So that is the second and fourth string if we go one, two, three, four. And then the third fret on the E string. So like a D on guitar if you play guitar. Um, and those are most of our chords for um, Volcano. There's another little bit uh, where we're gonna use a E. Um, e is a little bit trickier. Um, so we're gonna bar the first, sorry, bar the second fret and then the fourth fret we want to be pressing down on the G, C and E strings so these one two three now some people like to do it with two fingers yeah um, I personally can bend my finger that way and there are some people can't so I play it like that we're also going to be using a C C is nice and easy it's just that string there so third fret A string uh, gives you a C and uh, those are all the chords we're going to need for Volcano. Now, our main strum is kind of going to be a thumb down twice and a chunk. Okay, so it kind of gives us this boom, 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 boom. Uh, so we're going to start off with an A minor. So we go. So I'm going. Let me focus a bit here. So I'm going thumb, thumb, down, thumb, thumb, chunk, thumb, thumb, chunk. And I'm locking it kind of slightly with an up strum on my thumb, so it goes. So we do four on A. Okay, that's kind of our intro uh, start to the song. So we go four times on A minor. And then when we chunk the fourth time, we're going to switch to our G chord and thumb up and then switch to our F chord and go back into our thumb, thumb, chunk, up, thumb, thumb, chunk, up. So all together that should sound like, so we do that, sorry, four times on A, we hit the G on the up strong and then four times on F. So it goes. Now we do that kind of twice for the intro. Uh, so the pattern of four up and then four twice. Uh, and then I think for the first four, first verse you do it four times, but I might be wrong, it might be two. If you listen to the record, you'll know. So uh, it just repeats like that. And then the fourth time, Sorry, after we've done it enough times, we switch to uh, the G chord. So we then up strum with the G, but stay on the G for two. And then we switch to the F for two. So uh, I'll play it through. We've got A minor. So G, F. So 
we're going to switch to G. And then to F. And then to G. And then to F. So it goes A minor, G, F. G, 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 F, G, F. But for the G and F, you only go twice on the G and twice on the F. That leads us to our chorus, where we go back to the A minor and the F. But instead, this time, we again go only twice on the A minor and twice on the F, similar as we're doing to the G and the F. So it goes. Don't put the G in between. Okay, so I'll play that through for you. Uh, so we start on the A minor. I'll just go over the strum again, just in case you didn't catch it the first time. So it's just down, thumb down. You kind of want to catch the top three strings. You don't necessarily have to get the A string. You can if you want. So it's thumb, thumb, chunk, and then catch the bottom strings with your thumb on the way back up. Again, you don't need to play them all. Um, you can kind of vary it between if you want to just hit the top strings, the first thumb and then hit a lot more than the second thumb. So you can go. Or you can do a lot of them with the first one, and then just kind of the more bassy strings with the second, and then chunk. So you can either go. Or you can go. Yeah. Um, cool. So there's a bit as well where he kind of just plays chords. Uh, when it's the kind of what I give to you, it's nothing new, it's what I'm going through. So that chord progression uh, is C, G, F, sorry, A minor, then F, and then C, E, A minor, F, and that's kind of uh, played down, down, up, up, down, up. And then you kind of put a little frill on the end, so. Yeah. So all together that bit goes. So you go from doing the A minor to the F, A minor, F, into when you finish it, you go straight back into the A minor. Uh, G, F, A, uh, G, A minor, which is the intro bit. Cool, so that's how you play the song. Uh, it will give you that kind of bass sound, especially if you've got that low G. Um, 
you also have the kind of bridge or whatever you want to call it. There's also kind of a little solo which um, in shout out is completely by uh, Eat My Uke. Um, but I'll just show you that. You can find the tabs on his site so please do. Um, and that is you go on the A string and you go to the fifth fret. So you go slide up to the seventh, back down to the fifth. On the E string, you go third up to the fifth. So it goes. And this is kind of the bit the cello plays in the song, so. Do it through once, repeat again. But instead of going to the E string, you go up to the seventh on the A and then the tenth, uh, tenth on the A and then seventh on the A. So it goes. And then again we do it once more. And we do the first pattern. And this time on the E string we go seven, eight, seven, and then five immediate slide down to third. So all together, I'll do it slowly. And sped up, that should sound like. Okay, so it's almost like a hammer on pull off on that bit. That is all you need to do for Kato. So if you've got two people, one person can be doing the cello bit, so while someone else is going. Mm -hmm. 